Hey, it's your partner, man. Who? It's your partner, man. What's good with the people, man? How y'all doing on this uh warped Wednesday? You say warped Wednesday? What is you talking about, baby? Cuz warped Wednesday? Warped? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Warped? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Oh, we gonna get into it, but before we do that, man, what's good, people? Like hee hee, ha ha, man. You know what I'm talking about? Ken in the pen, man. All my folks incarcerated. All my folks who ain't, man. Everybody on the bottom of that thing, man. Everybody on the top of that thing, man. Keep that head up. You know what I'm talking about? Keep pushing. We gonna get through it to get to it, man. Let's get through these disclaimers, man. Before we do that, man, my mama said, no, we ain't even on the disclaimers, man. Oh, man, they over there trying to get the thing started. Uh, It ain't even that one, man. Uh, yeah, it's the same before we do that, man. What's good people like, uh, hold on, man. I almost forgot, man. You, uh, did I say can the pen? You know what I'm talking about? If I didn't go get that uh, stick up in stores now, you go get some off 76 Mac Carter the Giants. Look, is what I'm talking about. 82nd Hillside Barbershop. You know what I'm talking about? They say somebody put them in their uh, storage in the hundreds. Thank you, young man. Now you know you come get them from me. But if all else fails, man, you go grab you some of them things off of Amazon, man. So you copy a hardback, man. Also in storage. Funk or die trying, man. You know what I'm talking about? Go get you one. You know what I'm talking about? Uh-oh, what's that? Swing that finger, young man. You know what I'm talking about? Come on with it, bro. Worldwide INC, man. Come on with it, bro. Worldwide Incorporated. Come on with it, bro. Worldwide. Hey, I ain't going to say what does that mean, bro. And I'm going to continuously say, hey. It means everybody, man. You know what I'm talking about? Hey. Everybody included, man. You know what I'm talking about? And Dugu. Mike, uh, Cutthroat, Lil Rue, not Lil Rue, Lil Rue, you know what I'm talking about, Tata the player, that's who comes next, same thing, bro, everybody on the bottom of that thing, everybody on top of that thing, man, keep that head up, you know what I'm talking about, keep pushing, we gonna get through it to get to it, man, now let's get through these disclaimers, but before we do that, my mama said, my mama always said, boy, brush them whiskers when you on TV, boy, even if they got a hole in them, you know what I'm talking about, I almost forgot, man, <laughs> Coffee Chronicles, you know what I'm talking about, Coffee Chronicles, you know what I'm talking about? Now, let's get through them disclaimers. A good brother like myself, good brother like myself, I don't promote no drug usage. No, no, no. Don't promote no drug sellage. No, no, no. You know what I'm talking about? Don't promote no alcohol consumption. No, no, no. Man, I don't promote, uh, I don't know, uh, hold on, it ain't got to that part yet. Uh, no alcohol consumption. No, no, no. I don't promote no, uh, don't take a sip of the sippage. I don't promote no crime. No, no, no. I don't promote no uh, violence. No, no, no. I don't promote no domestic violence, man. No, no, no. You know what I'm talking about? Me, man, I don't promote shit. No, no, no. You know what I'm talking about? Me, man, all I promote is y'all go ahead and do what you're going to do with your time, young ladies and gentlemen. Make sure you find the right thing to do with your time, young ladies and gentlemen, because we just don't know how much of it we got, young ladies and gentlemen. But a good brother like myself, man, I ain't prejudiced. No, no, no. You know what I'm talking about? Like my I ain't got nothing against the sexually different, man. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't got nothing against the little people. No, no, no. Me, man, I ain't got nothing against nobody. They was talking to bruh. I love me some everybody. You know what I'm talking about? As a matter of fact, I'm on a quest. You know what I'm talking about? I'm bringing that peace. You know what I'm talking about? That joy. You know what I'm talking about? That love. You know what I'm talking about? That love. Back to the YouTube community, man. You with me? Come on over here and fuck with your partner, man. All right, check it out. Psst, 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 psst. Come fuck with a nigga one time, man. Man, what's good with the people, man? How are y'all doing out there, man? You feel what I'm saying, man? Uh, shout out to all the ugly people in the bathroom trying to get pretty. I'm, you're still in there? <laughs> God damn, I cracked myself up, man, you know what I'm talking about, you say, what's going on with it today, bro, oh, we talking about that Warped Wednesday, you say, Warped, yeah, man, what's Warped, do you, Warped, you know what I'm talking about, just Warped Wednesday, man, you say, what's that, bro, the way your motherfucking mind is, yeah, them days we living in, we living in Warped Wednesday, man, where a bunch of these motherfuckers' mind out here is warped with reality, man. You know what I'm talking about? That's why a lot of motherfuckers stay inside that computer. They don't be coming out. They don't come out that computer to real life. Because in that computer, and I'm not talking about, I'm just talking about social media, period, man. The Facebooks, the Instagrams, the, uh, all that shit y'all be throwing, y'all. And that was, that was, man, I cried last night, man. Say why you cried, baby, because... Man, I cried, man. You say, why did you cry, baby? Cause, man, because you niggas is warped. You niggas is warped, bruh. Do you realize there's a bunch of you niggas out here, bruh, that ain't never lived a real day in your life, nigga? 
Do you realize that? Like the realest shit you've ever done in your life was some fake shit. Coffee Chronicles. And that's what be hella funny about this computer. You know what I'm talking about? That's what be hella funny about this computer. Because they'll try to change history on this computer. Yeah, they will. They'll try to change history on this computer, man. But just warped. And everybody mind warped. I ain't gonna say everybody. But it's a good percentage of motherfuckers mind just warped, man. And I'm just here to tell you. Man, stay up out that shit. You ain't got to be on this contest they be having on this computer, bro. These niggas up here lying, bro. You get what I'm saying? These niggas up here lying, bro. You feel me? Just these people in the world, bro. These people just trying to obtain an image, man. These niggas just trying to, uh, if I said that right, obtain and uphold the motherfucking image, bro. That's all they trying to do. They want you to they they want you to believe that they somebody. You get what I'm saying? That's what they want you to believe. Man, listen, bro. Whether you is somebody or you ain't somebody, bro, it's gonna be told in the story. You know what I'm talking about? Greatest story ever told. Hey, <laughs> nephew says, old oh, man, old lady. Nephew says, old oh, man, old lady. Hey, what you say, bro? Old oh, lady. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Greatest story ever told. Coming soon, man. You know what I'm talking about? But on some real shit, we warped as a motherfucker, bro, as the people. We warped, man. We really sit here, bro. I seen a motherfucker who really sits here. Like I said, you can't get into it. I mean, you can't. You don't get along with nobody on earth. You get what I'm saying? Because niggas really don't be having friends on earth. So you come to this motherfucking uh, makeshift-ass computer and shit. You know what I mean? You could be having a horrible day. You get what I'm saying? But you come to this motherfucking computer and find some people that agree with you. And that makes you feel better. That's why motherfuckers love this computer shit. Because these computer people don't, don't got to know you for real. You could just sit up here in front of these computer people. You get what I'm saying? They don't know you. And that's what be yellow funny, man. You feel what I'm saying? And once again, I'm talking about all this shit. You say, what's all this shit, bro? All that Facebook, Twitter, all that shit niggas be starting to debate on. You get what I'm saying? All that shit niggas be trying to be right on. You get what I'm saying? We gonna start the worldly conversation about, man, fuck them worldly conversations. Niggas need to just get to it, bro. That's something we don't never do, bro. We just always sitting around talking about something because we warped. Because we actually believe sitting around and making a point to somebody about some of our issues is going to change the issues, bro. Mind warp, nigga. And you will sit up here on Twitter all day arguing back and forth, talking about the black people and the black man and the black bitch. And, and you'll, you'll have some good points, nigga. And that'll make you feel like you just motherfucking, like you accomplished something in the day, bro. Sitting up here uh, arguing with computer people, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Man, please. Please, warped Wednesday it is, bro. Because this computer came around and warped a lot of you motherfuckers' minds, folks. It just did. Yeah, this computer right here, man, it came around and it warped people's mind, man. It started, I told you a long time ago, this computer right here make you make you think that you're doing better than what you is. And it'll make you think that you're not doing as good as you is. You get what I'm saying? That's why you can't pay attention to the numbers. But they got everybody wrapped up in the numbers. Talking about some man, do you realize how you think them bitches like when the bitches be coming out there showing their bodies and shit? Because it's a million tricks, bro. That's why it'd be the same shit, folks. It's a million motherfuckers. Do you realize a lot of motherfuckers that might even a nigga might get a million views for a picture and can't the million people can't even speak English, they don't even know what you said, they just think you look funny or something, bro. You get what I'm saying, man? This shit crazy. Hey, this shit crazy as a motherfucker, bro. But this shit'll play tricks on motherfucker mind, folks. You know what I'm talking about? Facebook, Instagram. Got all you niggas out here fighting amongst one another. Got all you niggas getting up checking Facebook every motherfucking morning. Instagram every motherfucking morning, man, to see what a nigga said. Wonder is he talking about me? What did he mean by that? Looking ass nigga. They got your mind warped, bro. They got you out here as a man acting like a bitch. They got your mind warped, bro. And a lot of you niggas just been bitches your whole life. 
Now they got your mind warped like you're real. You feel me? Warped mind it is, bruh. You know what I'm talking about? And they say, bruh, why are you all the way up, man? Fuck you, niggas. I'm going to tell you that what I've been telling you, nigga. Fuck you, niggas. You know what I'm talking about? Coffee Chronicles. Coffee Chronicles, you know brain lying. Bruh been telling you fuck you. <laughs> you know bruh been telling you fuck you since you was an adolescent. <laughs> yeah, fuck you niggas, man. You know what I'm talking about? Because I realized a long time ago we was leaning towards this warpness, bruh. We living in the motherfucking day and age where everybody living inside their own motherfucking fantasy, folks. They is. And this shit getting harder and harder to deal with on earth. That's all I be talking about, bro. Like I said, bro, I don't be into this computer shit like that. I can just tell you where the behaviors came from. They came up off this computer. They came up off that TMZ shit. So they got niggas running around here like that baby police bitch. He on talking about who hired up. They got niggas running around here like the hoe. You get what I'm saying? That's what they got niggas running around here like. But niggas gonna run around here like the hoe and do all that shit, bro. And then act like it ain't hoe activity. I don't be talking to these motherfuckers, bro. That's just why I don't. I ain't got no time for that shit, bro. I don't. I just don't. There's more important things to do out here in life, folks. Whatever you might have to do is just way more important shit to be sitting around. Listening to a nigga's opinion about what you think. Man, please. Please, bruh. Because most people who got opinions, bruh, in real life, that's why they come to the computer with them, bruh. You feel me? Niggas jump on this computer and say shit that they wish they could say to motherfuckers in their real life. That's why I don't have that problem. Man, I don't, nigga, listen, bruh. Baby cuz is gonna tell you what's on baby cuz mind, nigga. Wherever we at, bruh, you know what I'm talking about? I might try to be kind with you for a few seconds. But after that, after that shit burns, baby cuz nerves up, man, I'm just gonna tell you what it is, bruh. I might try to give you a break. I might try to play the game with you for a little second, you know what I'm talking about? But we ain't gonna do that too long. You feel what I'm saying? So hopefully when I start playing the game with you, you could recognize that I'm just playing the game with you and you ain't got too long. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? So maybe you'll check yourself. But most of the time, they don't. You know what I'm talking about? And they leave it up to the baby cuz to check them. <laughs> yeah, I ain't lying to you, baby. Nephew, sis, old man, old lady. Nephew, sis, old man, old lady. Hey, what you say, bro? Old man, old lady. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? They say, bro, where do you be getting that shit from? Out this head of mine. You know what I'm talking about? We warped, though, folks. As a motherfucker. We warped as a motherfucker. Niggas, bitches, the kids, the people. We just warped, bruh. Because we just living in this shit, bruh. We just living in the world that, uh, I'm talking about the real world, bruh. Where all niggas find value in is... Running they mouth. I don't know, bro. I can't. Because I can't even explain it to you. Without you saying, oh, you must be perfect. So I'm just going to, I'm going to save you the, uh, I'm just going to save you that. But at some point in time, I'm going to continue to tell you this until I'm gone. You're supposed to be learning from that shit you're going through, folks. You get what I'm saying? I ain't no way in the world that you fucked your tax money up last year. You should be able to, uh, to fuck your tax money up this year, bro. The first time you fucked your money up, bro, you didn't learn no lesson from that, bro. You goofy. And that's what's wrong with us. That's how we warp. Because we goofy. You will sit here, bruh, trying to keep up with some imaginary people who ain't paying attention to you. You trying to, like, y'all act like y'all really the celebrities or something, bruh. Like y'all got the streets buzzing. We got Instagram buzzing. We got Facebook buzzing. Everybody talking, bruh, that ain't everybody, bruh. I'm around some people that don't know nothing about that shit. 
you niggas crazy. That's just how small these niggas circles be, man. That be hella funny, bro. Y'all be talking about the, the, I got the streets buzzing, bro. That's the same 20, 35 motherfuckers you know in life, bro. That ain't the streets buzzing, bro. Them just the people that's nosy paying attention to you, bro. Don't nobody give a fuck about that shit. They don't. Our mind warped, bro. We goofy. Nigga, you on Instagram. Or taking pictures or however y'all do that shit. I told you, Brett, Brett just posted his product. He don't talk about I'm gone. I, I don't be on that shit listening to y'all, bro. I told you, I learned my, somebody ran me into that shit a long time ago when I got out the uh when I got out of jail, bro. Bro, just get on Facebook. You're gonna run into everybody you looking for. Man, that shit ain't nothing but the big ass mess. A mess pot. And I learned. I learned my lesson. Just like I learned my lesson jumping on them kids live. Baby cuz be learning from the shit he be going through. I ain't fucking with y'all no more. I ain't. Cause y'all hella boozy and in real life I ought to beat the shit out of a few of you. Coffee Chronicles. That's why I don't like the computer. Cause it's just easy to say shit out your mouth. You feel me? It's easy to come up here where a nigga can't put his hands on you and grab you real quick. You feel me? It's easy to do that. It's just easy. Even me, bro, I can sit up here and just hurl a bunch of threats. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, nigga, and when I say, man, that shit ain't cool, bro. Man, that shit ain't cool. It ain't, bro. They got us warped. They got you thinking that's what the people want to see. Man, the only people want to see that is the messy-minded motherfuckers, bro. I don't even want them people around me. I don't. Them people right there in real life that don't get nothing done, bro. I'm talking about nothing done in real life, bro. They just sitting around watching the next motherfucker waiting for the next incident or whatever to happen so they can talk about it. You know what I'm talking about? That's just like the motherfuckers that job to take their job more serious than their life. They picture perfect at work, bro. They know everything. They do everything, bro. You know what I'm talking about? But you go home in the real world and can't even uh, keep up with a, a simple bill or something, bro. That's that, uh, that's that makeup. You know what I'm talking about? That's that dope fiend in the penitentiary eating hella brick bread. Now he hella clean and shit, even though this nigga homeless on the street, filthy as a motherfucker. He the cleanest nigga in jail now. He get back off that brick bread. You get what I'm saying? Now he running around calling everybody else dirty and shit. It's important to him to keep the pie clean. You know what I'm talking about? That's the shit he having fights about. Because it's important to keep that pie clean. Because you're going to be the cleanest motherfucker in jail. You know what I'm talking about? The goofiest motherfucker in the world, though. You don't get the fuck out of here with that shit. That's that makeup. You know what I'm talking about? I'm trying to make up for something else I don't do. I'm going to come to jail real quick. The fat bitch sending me 200 a week. You know what I'm talking about? So I'm finna ball in jail real quick. Because on the streets, I'm really broke. But I'm finna ball out in jail. Big spreads in front of your face so you can see me. You know what I'm talking about? But on the streets, it don't work like that. So here's my chance to be somebody. That's that makeup. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? That's that makeup. But we warped. And once again, these motherfuckers always they say, bro, you just be a contradicting yourself. Uh, all right. All right. If that's what you're looking for. All right. You feel me, man? I should just judge you. Why are you trying out how to make me wrong or debate me some kind of way? If that's all you listening to or listening for, you're going to miss out. You feel me? And that's what's wrong with his mind warp. That's why we always missing out. And I'm going to tell all you niggas, and I don't give a fuck, right? Because for some reason, motherfuckers act like, bro, you didn't give a fuck about you. Because I'm tired of seeing you niggas goofy. I really wish it was somebody in the real world. I mean, it's a few of them. But in the real world, I just wish it was more niggas I could fuck with. Nigga like players. But that ain't happening. That ain't happening. That's why I wish niggas had changed. 
That's how you know all you niggas lying and full of shit. The whole black race community, nigga. Because all that same nigga trying to take the bitch tax money and buy a box here. The money just fell out the air. Coffee Chronicles. Everybody just put themselves on stage at the same time, bro. You niggas left a, a digital diary of how you think. You know what I'm talking about? All them good ass pictures and you just keep watching the pictures, the pictures, bam, it started back to normal. You know what I'm talking about? You know how the before picture was, then the after picture, then the after that picture was the same as the before picture. Coffee Chronicles. Our mind warped. It showed how goofy we is at one time and the <laughs> nigga everybody said. <laughs> it ain't funny. I ain't laughing at y'all, man. I'm glad you got to see it, man. Fuck it, live, man. Take, <laughs> take your chance, bro. Fuck it. But I'm just saying, bro, that shit showcase how you niggas think. It did, bro. That shit just showcase how you niggas think, bro. We really don't be wanting nothing, bro. We don't. All motherfuckers be wanting is to show off, nigga, for a good 15, 25 minutes. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, man? You can't think further. Your mind doesn't think that far. And I'm not even capping, bro. I feel sorry for a lot of motherfuckers, bro, because your mind don't think that far. Nigga, it's crucial times right now, bro. You talking about some rims and a beams. Man, you don't get the fuck away from me, folks. You don't get the fuck away from me, bro. It's more to life, folks. You just got to find it. I don't know how you find it, folks. It's like I say, I can't tell you nothing, even though I'll be up here telling you a bunch of shit. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? I can't really tell you nothing, bro. I can just tell you our mind warped. We hella goofy, bro. Hella goofy, and we just getting goofier by the day. Coffee Chronicles. Y'all don't know them, the, the, the everything y'all say is what somebody told you, bro. What your mama told you, what your daddy told you. Man, motherfuckers told me a lot of shit. I ain't listening to none of that shit, bro. Because a bunch of the shit they told me wasn't true. A gang of that shit was. You know what I'm talking about? But I had to find out for myself. I couldn't listen to nobody. I had to find out for myself. I suggest you do the same thing. You feel me? Because a lot of motherfuckers don't know what they be talking about, man. You got to realize whether you a kid. Nigga, grown-ups be telling the kids shit out of a space of anger sometimes. Just be mad and telling nigga something, bro. Man, that shit ain't real. That motherfucker ain't never just got mad and told you some shit like that. And don't go in that room no more. And if you open the door... You know what I'm talking about? It's a motherfucker behind there with a chainsaw and they gonna knock your head. Or, you know what I'm talking about? They'll just tell a kid anything, bro. And, go, and that's what we do. Our people just walk around just like how niggas compete with everything, bro. You can't do nothing, bro. I actually heard niggas trying to make another nigga. I told y'all this years ago when I first came here. Trying to make another nigga feel bad about him getting some money. Or about a motherfucker leaving a motherfucker a house or something, bro. Like, if your people left you a house, nigga, you got another motherfucker talking about, nigga, you wouldn't even have a house, nigga, if your people wouldn't have left it to you. What difference do that make? Nigga, I got a house. You goofy ass, nigga. You trying to make this nigga feel guilty because you ain't got shit, nigga. Nigga. Why your people didn't leave you something, nigga? Your people didn't have nothing to leave. And they be having y'all embarrassed by shit like that, bro. Oh, you wouldn't have no money if you didn't have no settlement. Man, get the fuck up out of here, man. You wouldn't have no money if you got a settlement, nigga. Nigga. They can give you a $3 million settlement, nigga. By the end of the week, you'll have $250,000 left. Goofy ass, nigga. Y'all kill me with that shit. They say, bro, you be mad. I really don't be mad. Lightweight, passionate. You get what I'm saying? Bro, get on one. You know what I'm talking about? Bro, just get on one, lightweight, passionate. If you can say what you want to, I ain't even want to do this shit right here, bro. The pen asks for this. You know what I'm talking about? So I gave them to him. Because we used to be sitting around. See, I'm one of them niggas that's always been valuable, bro. Information since a kid, bro. I told you they called me a Keely Mojo, man. Find out what that means. You know what I'm talking about? Intelligent one. Always been sharp. I didn't go to school. I went to life. You know what I'm talking about? 
You know, I ain't go to school. I want the life. I hung around that shit for a while, but even while I was hanging around, man, I ain't go to school. I'm one of them niggas that got a 0.0, .0 grade point average, nigga. I ain't even go to school enough to even get a grade, nigga. They gave me some shit like an NF. I couldn't even just get an F. I ain't even go to school, nigga, for them, uh, enough for them people to give me an F. You know what I'm talking about? Bro was in the wind. Coffee Chronicles. Yeah, I was in the wind. And if I had it to do all over, I'd do it again. <laughs> Nephew, sis, old man, old lady. Nephew, sis, old man, old lady. Hey, what'd you say, bro? Old lady. You know what I'm talking about? On some real shit. We warped as a motherfucker, though, bro. There ain't no saving us. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? I wish we could uh, turn around, but it look like we just leaning, leaning in the direction where it ain't no saving us, folks. Because this shit, get, it gets wild in real life, folks. It gets wild in real life. This shit crazy, folks. So I should just, all right, man, just find out yourself, folks. Because we warped. You know what I'm talking about? From the kids to the church people, everybody warped. The church people steadily running around trying to tell you some shit another nigga told them. You know what I'm talking about? I don't want to hear that shit, bro. I don't. You know, I got love for the church people who mean good. I got love for the church people who believe that shit. I ain't got no love for the church people who, I mean, I still got love. I got love for everybody, so just run your game. But the ones who just be using that shit to run game, man, I don't respect that shit. And you get mad because I can see that shit. They get mad when you, nigga, anything. It ain't even the church people. Nigga, anybody on earth gonna get mad as fuck when you spot that gang, bro. That's why I ain't got a lot of friends. I just ain't the one to go for it, bro. I'm not. I'm not, bro. I'm the best nigga I know at everything, and nigga. I'm the best problem solving nigga I know. I'm just the, you know what I'm talking about? And I ain't talking about no mad problems, bro. I'm talking about on earth, nigga. Bro, I'm gonna come to the logical decision and get to it, bro. Whatever the logical decision is. See, a lot of y'all don't think with logic because a lot of times the logic, uh, the logic decision, be some shit which y'all will consider illegal because that's what these people told y'all. Shit, nigga. If it was a pound of coke right here, nigga, and all you had to do was go drop that motherfucker off somewhere, nigga, and they was gonna give you thousands, nigga. But you sitting right there talking about I'm an honest man, nigga. You goofy as a motherfucker is what you is, nigga. Scary ass, nigga. You goofy as a motherfucker, nigga. So you gonna keep uh, sitting around applying to the marriage? Do you realize, bro? I'm talking about, I swear to God, I've witnessed it myself in the work field, and I ain't got nothing against working. This is just why our mind warped, nigga, because they told you that was an honest living, nigga. Ain't nothing honest about that shit, nigga. Them people gonna, nigga, build their company off your motherfucking back, nigga. That's what these people gonna do. Whatever company you work for, nigga, whatever you doing for their company, nigga, them people is building their motherfucking company up off your motherfucking back. That's why motherfuckers is expendable, nigga. That's why I walked out my last job. That nigga told me everybody replaceable. Nigga, you won't replace me in the next 40 minutes. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, nigga? And guess what? You're going to replace me with your self. You know what I'm talking about? So you get out here and do all that shit, bitch ass nigga. That's what you do with these next 40 minutes. I guess everybody is replaceable. But guess what? Nigga, they ain't replaceable right now on this next 40, 45 hour to 10 minutes. You know what I'm talking about? Dude, I was supposed to be up in here, nigga. I'm gone, nigga. I ain't got no time for that shit. I don't. I ain't going to sit around here and play with you. Because you ain't just going to say anything out your mouth, folks. Warped. That's how they got the people. Warped. You get what I'm saying? So you can go to a job. Another nigga, he's a supervisor, but he got a job just like you. You get what I'm saying? But he feels like some kind of way he's over you. Man, you don't get the fuck up out of here, nigga. We on the same clock, bro. When we get up off this motherfucker, I'll beat your ass. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, bro? Don't forget about that, nigga. You know what I'm talking about? No, don't never forget about that. Mm -mm. Yeah, don't forget about that one. On some real shit, we warped, bruh. We so warped, we don't even come with the love no more, folks. You know what I'm saying, bruh? You was just talking about beating somebody ass. Like talking about, man, y'all know how that shit get. But you know, bruh really got love. Bruh just don't be the one for the disrespect. But they got us warped, bruh. They got you greeting your people with, uh, with, uh, disrespect, bruh. They done taught you how to hate your people. For real, bro. We all over the place, bro. We just is. We all over the place, bro. We all over the place. 
Right now, if it was a ride on Earth, bro, we'd lose. Nah, I'll take that, bro. Cause if it was a ride on Earth, that's something we good for, nigga. <laughs> we'd drop everything, nigga, right now, right now. Nigga, go get on some shit. Like, right now, right now. That shit <laughs> ain't gonna matter. <laughs> Where they at? You know what I'm talking about? That shit get to looking like the Alabama brawl with the people who help. But see, they got your mind warped. <clears throat> just like that brawl, man. I'm glad I just brought that up. Do you realize how many people was right there that didn't help? That just pulled out their phone? You feel me? Watch them jump. What was that nigga name? Earl Ray or something? He had one of them names. You know what I'm talking about? What was that nigga name? He had two names. I forgot what auntie was calling that nigga. You know what I'm talking about? But that, that's what I'm saying, bro. The people actually came, though. But you know what I'm talking about? But it was people already there, bro. They decided to pull out their phone, man. Man, y'all ever see me getting jumped on? I wouldn't give a fuck who was by it, man. You pull out your phone. Y'all better hope they did me a number. You know what I'm talking about? Y'all better hope they did me a number. Because I got any energy left, man. Once I get up, nigga. Once I get up, nigga, please. Don't forget to record this. Yeah, don't forget to record this, nigga. Y'all got that shit bad, man. Help the people sometime, man. I ain't talking about getting nobody business, bro. You know when, you know when the motherfucker getting done wrong, though, bro. I ain't talking about getting nobody business, bro. Like the Alabama brawl, man. You don't let people jump on your people. I'm talking about some shit like that. You know what I'm talking about? But just don't jump in nobody's business, bro. Because we full of shit out here, bro. And it's a good chance that we done did something to them people who mad. So get you a good gauge of what you getting into, too, bro. Just don't be running around here trying to be no motherfucking vigilante superhero and shit. Just figure like you're going to get jumping people's business, man. You get your ass popped. What's some real shit. But Warp Wednesday, we Warp Wednesday. I don't know, bro. I can't even call it, nigga. I don't know what the fuck we gonna do. I just, uh, cause like I said, in the real world, bro, everybody just slowly, but, uh, it ain't even slowly, nigga. Fastly just adapting to this fake shit, this fuckery, bro. Just in real life. And everybody just starting to be the same way, man. Feel me? Everybody just starting to be the same way, bruh. That's why in real life, everybody running into each other. Anybody that got them ways, the messy, I keep telling y'all that shit, bruh. All that mess shit and want to talk behind your back and all that old, and we think this funny. All, all the motherfuckers run into each other, bruh. Because they all do the same shit, bruh. Everybody going to run into each other, man. You got the same ways, you going to run into the same motherfucker with the ways like you. Man, listen, wake up in the morning, fuck these people. Thank God for waking up in the morning. Fuck these people, man. Uh, I can't even pronounce that word right. Itinerary, nigga. You check your itinerary. Hey, I'm talking about the breath saying that right. You get what I'm saying? And you get everything out the way you need to do, bruh. You get what I'm saying? You get everything out the way you need to do, bruh. Start focusing on your own business, bruh. That's the only way you're going to ever have something, bruh. But they got your mind warped, bruh. They do. They got you around here celebrating and praising everybody else, bruh. And they just got your mind warped, bruh. They got your mind so warped, you don't even got a plan for yourself. They got your mind so warped, you ain't even got a plan for yourself, bruh. You you sitting around watching everybody else, what they do, bruh. And now you trying to, I told you, now we trying to uh, reenact that shit on earth. You hoes sitting around here watching these other bitches go out on the trip. Now you hoes want to go to Miami. Now you hoes want to go to Cancun. You get what I'm saying? You niggas sitting around here watching these niggas do something. Now y'all want to do something, man. I seen when you niggas try to do that shit all the side, bro. I said, if y'all don't quit, bro, who thought that was a good idea, bro? I told y'all, bro, y'all listen to Sagoonies, nigga. Who thought that was a good idea? We gonna have nine, ten niggas around here, bro. We, nigga, I wish I would tell you niggas about some shit I'm going through. <laughs> you niggas don't get the fuck up out of here with that shit, nigga. You niggas watch too much TV, but <laughs> y'all just do. <clears throat> Who thought that was a good idea, bro? You niggas really be living in them fantasy worlds, bro. 
Y'all be trying to reenact it, shit, bro, and y'all ain't even them type of people. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? It's just like y'all be wanting that type of shit. You ain't even the type of person to get that type of shit, bro. You have to be valuable and worth something first, bro. You can't just want shit. You feel what I'm saying? And that's why y'all keep running in each other, bro. That's why ain't nobody staying married. <laughs> None of that shit, bro. You know what I'm talking about? You, you, that's just why, bro. Because a lot of y'all don't be the people worth having that shit. Coffee Chronicles. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? We be sitting around here playing. <clears throat> and you notice how the fake motherfucker, like, we be talking about real, talking about, because we real people, motherfucker always want to self-proclaim what they is, they self. That's why niggas have fun on this computer, because you can name you anything yourself, you know what I'm talking about? Magic Triple OG, the threat, and all that old type of shit, man. Magic Triple OG, the threat looking ass, nigga, you know what I'm talking about? Come on, y'all. That's why niggas be up here playing fantasy games. That's why niggas always up here, bro. Because in real life, nigga, they, man, please, bro. They can't function in real life like they function on this computer, nigga. You know what I'm talking about? But I be through all this shit, nigga, mobbing. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, nigga? All this shit, nigga, mobbing. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? But what do I know? With that one right there, man, you don't remember nothing else. And I mean, if you don't remember nothing else, man, always remember. It don't cost nothing, man, just to show a little bit of that love.